This European Cricket Network event is proudly brought to you by HCL Software and Bizaway. Shot. No run. Backward point comes into play. And Oh, well, I just put the kibosh on him as that trickles past the helmet, and that'll be a genuine four buys. The keeper, Bamboozle, push barrage and Bamboozle. That swung late. It's a very loose stroke as it goes all the way for four. Shot. There it is. We've been waiting for the first shot of conviction. That's a great hit for six. And the first over, which was pretty effective from Islam, in the end, it goes for 17. I wonder if they're brothers. That might be something. Uh, I dare say so. Looking up, certainly looks similar. This one's gone up in the air, and it's a catch. That's the first catch that he's taken so far this series. Really good one out in the deep. Nagy gets his first wicket of this series as well. Missed time by Pushparajan. Hasn't quite had the series he's been hoping for. Oh. Uh, this is wallop. Now that's the chump course thing we know. Hammers a massive six. And uh, Nagy just gets a little bit of a reality check. Damage. Oh, plays all around that one, Chum Corsing. And it looks like he's a bamboozled the keeper once again. Yeah, the batters are batting at less than a run of ball. The run rate's at nine and a half. This one, he hasn't quite managed to get hold of it. And he's held on to that catch really well. It wasn't that easy for Danish. I think the good thing was it just hung up in the air a little longer, which uh, many could get around to it. And take that catch. The second wicket falls. Both Chumgore Singh and Pushparajan. Uh, he hasn't quite timed this one. It's come off the top of his bat. And uh, that's a well taken catch by Jaidul Islam. You have to say the Blasters have been really good with their catching. Some of these catches they've taken haven't been that simple. This is. Uh, be struck towards long on. Oh, it's going to take a good bit of fielding to prevent a boundary. Oh, oh he pushes <laughs> it onto the rope. I don't think you've done well enough. And he tapped it away for. Look at this. Does the job. Passes it on. And it's staying in play. And then Negi gets a little fingertip on it and deflects it the wrong way for four. Uh, his own brother doesn't help him out at long off. This is uh, struck away. Goes straight to Dianish. Makes no mistake. The second catch he takes this morning. He actually got a good piece of this. Yeah, probably would have gone for six. That's two catches he's taken. Oh, this one's gone up in the air. It's going to clear the boundary rope comfortably. Big hit by Rajan. And a much-needed six for the Royal Strikers. Finally get a hold of one. A little bit of length on offer. And he smacked that one really firmly right out of the middle of the bat. And he gets a hold of one. This is coming straight to the commentary tent. And, uh, well... Managed to drop in. Well done, this Great, great one-handed take on the half volley. <laughs> and uh, that was a slower ball. Read that one pretty well, Rajin. And he picks out the vacant boundary. Goes away for a four. Oh, he, that is a really, really good stroke. Incredible hit there by Sudarsana. And gets a hold of this one and whacks it over mid-wicket. Oh, brilliant ball there by Doble. Absolutely fantastic. That's an example of how you should uh, do some death over bowling. Yorker right at the stump, cleans him up. Oh, goes for the wide Yorker. He just misses it. Yeah, this is struck straight towards Nagy, and that's the first error we've uh, seen in the field. It's going to be interesting to see whether this is a four or a six. I have a feeling it's a four. It's gone through his hands. Did it go over the rope? There's the drop. He'll be disappointed. And he drops it for four. He's going to throw his bat at this one. There's no one behind point at the boundary. It's going to be signaled to four. We'll have another look at it to confirm. And this should be the conclusive replay. As you can see, it's well inside the rope. And that's pretty clear. It's a four. Good bit of uh, batting here at the end by Sudarsana. And he puts his team in a really good position.
Let's have a look at the first ball. Push towards mid on and uh, looked like it was going to be a slightly tight single. Oh, another one that's going to go beyond the fielder at point this time. Maybe he got a touch too short there. Oh, no, he's right there. He's setting very square. This is a little bit full by Islam. Yeah, this is going to beat the fielder at mid-off. Does it have enough to go to the rope? It does. Bottom edge into the pitch, and that will go away for four. Uh, top edge. It's... Uh, Gonna go away for a four. Oh, and he gets a wicket. Very first ball. Incredible. Full and straight delivery. Gets a little bit of movement as well in the air. And he cleans up Islam. That, that's the thing. He, he sets up like a spinner. But it's sort of front of the hand. And he bowls these little swingers both ways. Uh, Sathi gets his first ball. God! Well, two in two. Push Parajan has come in. He's bowled two very full deliveries. This one's an inside edge. That goes onto the stumps. He's going to be on a hat trick and the game changes. 31 for three. I think you, you'd be in prime position. He's going to block out this hat trick ball. Yeah, game on. Oh! Well, that is why people are asking why keepers wear helmets. Whoa. That really took off the edge and boomed into his head. Low full toss, hammered away. Looks like there was one bounce in front of the rope. We'll uh, just confirm on the replay. Yeah, we'll have a closer look. It, it's a poor ball. And where's that rope? That's going to be six, I think, actually. It looks like it's just bounced over the rope. So that'll be six runs. Uh, goes a little straight there, but forget about the fielders. That one's cleared the boundary rope. Yeah, and all of a sudden, all that pressure that had built is just released. And is this going to clear the rope? It certainly will. He's going for that wide Yorker there, seeing he just misses it. Gives him enough time to get underneath the ball, and he elevates it over the rope for six. Oh, this is a nice slower ball. There's a catching opportunity. He does get the wicket right at the end, so maybe he gets a bit of respite back. 19 runs off that over, but the dangerous Siddiqui departs. Is this going to clear the fielder? It certainly will. Goes for a six. Oh, that's, that's close. That's a really tight one, and it's been given out. Yeah, I think that's out. He, he uh, remonstrated that he said he got bad on it, but I'm not too sure he did. That looked like it was going to go into leg stump. The umpire has a split second to make a decision. Uh, this Ooh. one goes up in the air. It's going to take a good catch by the keeper to hold on to this, and he does. Really well done. Tracks the ball well. And this uh, multi sun he had to look right up. And that's a well-taken catch. More importantly, this is a dot ball. Oh, he's shot. Uh, he's probably over-pitched that one. He's going to get punished for it. It's all come down to Maython. He's going to have to play a big innings right at the end. This one's gone high up in the air. It's been sky, and it's going to clear the boundary. A big six here by Maythani. It's been another expensive over for Singh so far, and we could be in for some late innings heroics. It's down to 19, needed of nine. Go! Oh, goes a bit too short, and he gets punished. He's been pumped for another six, three sixes of the first four balls of this over. Well, this over had to go big. <laughs> and he has he found the boundary up. This is gonna, looks like there's a fielder coming underneath it. He takes the catch. Good catch out of the deep. He's done the right thing there, Surya. But he won't get his side any runs. So 12 needed off the final over. Oh. He's gone up in the air. This is a huge moment. Will he take the catch? Push Barajan. He holds on to it. The captain holds on to the catch. And could that be the match deciding moment? Mm, you think it might be. Uh, Mathani was the key. Uh, he just didn't get the distance. He got elevation. A lot of credit going to Paul here. Oh, and he's run him out. He's in trouble there, Islam. He's gone. The umpire at square leg raises his finger. And I was just wondering if Islam could get on strike. Maybe if he middles a couple, the Blasters still have a chance. So they need back-to-back -back sixes to win this game. Is that going to happen? 
Yeah, he's just moving around a bit too much. I think he needs to stay nice and still if he wants to hit a six, but it's not going to matter. They won't get a run there. And one legal delivery here from Paul should do the trick. Terrific spell right at the death. Comes in during the pressure over. He's given up just three runs off the 11 deliveries he's bowled. He's also managed to pick up two important wickets. And that's the first run that has come this over. Terrific final over by Clinton Paul. Gave up just one run, held his nerve in a pressure cooker situation. And it looks like the Royal Strikers are going to take this one by 10 runs. A really, really good victory for them.